My name is Paul Bradbury. I'm a master bat maker for Bradbury Cricket in Perth, Western Australia. My partner and I, Sally, uh, started the business in 1993. We still use the tools that were traditionally used. We use a horse's shin bone for polishing, which is, people think, <laughs> why? But it's uh, something that actually does help. So you're looking at anywhere between three and four hours per bat. We began our business in Tasmania. That's where I met a young guy called Ricky Ponting, who was about 17, and he wanted to buy some bats off us. And from there, we found ourselves pretty soon um, with all our customers being first-class international cricketers, rather than the general public, which is normally the other way around. Soon after that, we found ourselves making bats for top international players. And so the, dem the demand was there from them, and yet the shops didn't want us. <laughs> but it's very exciting. We used to watch the cricket in a different way because we'd try and work out if they were using one of ours. Long-time users, a lot of the English guys like uh, Mark Butcher, Alex Stewart. New Zealand side we made for Brendan McCullum, Craig McMillan, Sri Lanka, Kumar Sangakara, and Australia, Ricky Ponting, Steve War, Langer. At one point there was eight of the Aussies using ours out of the 11, 2001 Ashes in England. We've uh, been, I guess, classically trained to use the old techniques and over the years we've coupled machinery and technology to marry the two together to produce high quality cricket bats.